Saludos, mi gente, Rafi Media Vida de Criticólogos. Y me encuentro aquí en Puerto Rico con mi con. With, with somebody is really special to me because of how humble he is. Uh, Robin, Robin Lord Taylor. Robin, welcome to, to, to Puerto Rico Comic Con. Welcome to Criticólogos. Oh, muchas gracias. It's oh. so amazing being here. Yeah, I, I'm, I love it here. I can't wait to come back. In Spanish and everything. Un poquito. <laughs> um, I, I gotta ask about uh, Gotham, the, the last season. Um, so so many emotions right so many emotions that yeah. we we have to we we, we you no know, we, we felt so many emotions you did such a great job uh, in, in interpreting the, the the different versions of danny devito's uh penguin was that by default or was that something you developed by, by time in time i mean I, you know i grew up watching batman returns ever since i was a kid and so i've seen that movie i don't know 100 times or something so you know danny devito's performance has always been part of my life so i think like Going forward, playing the Penguin in the future, or as I just did on Gotham, it, you know, it was like there's always going to be part of Danny's performance. Is is it's in me, you know? It's so, and I also wanted to, I wanted to honor, you know, what he had done with the character. So, you know, I think the the main thing that I took from Danny was just like, just like you know the 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 sense of humor that Penguin has. Like you would think that you know he would be you know completely serious all the mm -hmm. time, but that's not interesting you have to find a way to find that like y y that malevolent glee underneath the character mm -hmm. and and Danny of course is, is amazing and he nailed that and so like everything I wanted to make sure that I honored it honored him and that was sort of what I took from it yeah um, obviously you took some you took a bunch of things from, from Danny what, uh, what does it what does it mean to you that you have the opportunity to you know to play this iconic role uh, it means I, I still can't really wrap my brain around it because you know I just I'm I just want to work. I just want to be an actor. I don't want to have to like <laughs> wait tables or doing it. You know, like that was where I was coming from. And then, you know, to get a job and have it be my first big job and then to have it be about Batman and about the Batman origin, mm -hmm. it just, you can't, you can't ever expect that. Mm -hmm. You can't ever, I, I still don't believe that it happened. And so, you know, going forward, it was really scary mm -hmm. when I got the job because, you know, it's, I, I, I wanted to do good and I wanted to like, you know, to, to impress people and also to do something different with the mm -hmm. character and bring Penguin into a new, gen or introduce him to a new generation of fans. And so, yeah, but you know, it, it just, it means the world to me. And, and to, to be here and to be meeting kids and adults who you know who who love the batman story and 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 have them say like kind things and so be so nice about you know what we did on our show it just it, it means so much and and i just i i feel so much love in my heart because of it two final questions to let you go what do you want the batman the gotham fandom to take away from the city city spirituality what do you that what do you want, what do you want them to take away and let's talk about quickly briefly about i, I was surprised when i saw you and john wayne yes, like, is yeah. that robin yes. i mean it was so fun <laughs> speak about tell me what do, you, what do you want the fans to take away from from the other gotham city spirituality and just let, let, tell me uh, how did the, the, the john wick came about yeah well i was telling my friend mikey earlier about i was talking about gotham and really we just wanted to you know to bring these characters into a more real life place while still maintaining that comic book aspect because you know Batman is a story about human beings who you know experience incredible hardship in life and some of them choose the right path mm -hmm. and some of them choose the wrong path but it's almost like the path was decided for them mm -hmm. and so we really want to just bring that to these characters and also just like really f root them in a human experience and I feel like everybody on our show just did an amazing job doing that and then John Wick 3 that was just you know my my agent called me and she was like okay she was like it's a tiny tiny part it was but, awesome. well that's the thing and then like you know just and again like I, just to be there on the set and to be part of that 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 world and that you know that story i mean that's it's I, iconic yeah. and i didn't die so who knows <laughs> <laughs> thank you thank you robin thank you for everything thank and good luck on the future thank you so much seguimos aquí no se vaya nadie Thank you very much. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome.